bus, up the bus, up the bus is running down it. Oh, girl Tia, I'm so happy right now because the buses are finally running down our street. They haven't been running down our street like ever since we fucking moved in here because they're trying to like um, fix construction in Inglewood, which I appreciate. But god damn, it took fucking forever. Yeah, I'm so happy so I can go to the damn gym because I hate spending like close to $10 for a lift and $10 back. Like, it's insane. I'm thinking about changing my hairstyle today. I don't know. But yeah, let's do that. Hello, hello. So I shaved my armpit to put some deodorant on. It smells good. I'm ready for my gym date. <laughs> there you go. So pretty, I love these freaking earrings. Anyway, so I'm so happy today. Yesterday was my day off, but I had like a emo moment. I was just like, hello darkness, my old friend. And I really didn't do much yesterday at all. Today is a new day and I'm so excited because I'm finally going to go to the gym. I miss going to the gym so much. I haven't gone because like I said before, because of the construction on my street. So I'm really excited about that. And then today I'm going to watch Little Mermaid, The Little Mermaid with my mom because uh, Hailey Bailey, hello. And also I know she's gonna kill it. She's such a good singer. Like she is literally a siren. Every time she sings, I cry. And I've been hearing a lot of really good reviews about it. Fuck the racist people. Fuck y'all motherfuckers. Um, at the end of the day, she's winning, ho. She's winning, ho. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited to watch the movie. Um, I heard that they changed it a slight bit, but um, doesn't sway the fact that a lot of people like it. Doesn't sway that so many people are supporting it. So I'm so freaking excited to watch that with my mom. Pretty much the two main things that are going on in my life that I'm really excited about: the gym. And the Little Mermaid with my mom. So for today's gym session, I can't say that word, gym session, Jesus Christ. Anyway, so um, yeah, I didn't know what the hell to do. I haven't gone to the gym in so long, so I did these really awkward bent arm rows, single rows, and they're all right. And then I decided to do assistant pull-ups because I can't pull myself up for shit. Like my arm strength is like I'm i'm very strong but at the same time not when it comes to the back so i'm trying to work on that and then i did face pulls which i don't do as often but oh my god i felt it that day and it felt amazing now i have to do a full well a face pull every time i go to the gym but yeah um i wish i had a plan <laughs> that day but it was all good i was just happy that i went to the gym it's like a therapy session and also lately with my mental health i've been going through a lot ever since i moved out i feel like i'm trying to find my routine again and i was just like being completely honest on my fit channel that i have not my fit channel my fit instagram and i posted this and a lot of people were really happy to m see me talk about something so personal because you're not alone
like do it like this from the top it's like I it's everything becomes too salty but if I just pinch it it's perfect it's the perfect amount of salt especially since this thing has huge holes in it as you can see like it could spread like lately my eggs haven't been super salty because of that so it makes me want to get like that salt like little bowl where you get a bunch of your salt and you can just like pinch it ever since i went to my sister's house and she had that in her house i was like oh my god i have to have that in my house and i mean i can easily just use use something like this like have a bunch of salt put it in here so i can pinch it but aesthetically i want the thing that says actual salt and i could just like pinch it you probably have that on timu or something like that or shein but absolutely lately i've been loving timu more than i love shein because shein kind of takes quite some time to get here now when timu actually comes like within a few days of like shopping um, timu and what's funny is that my mom got me into it because at first i was like i don't know about this website mom well, this app but now i'm obsessed there's like so much cute stuff and no i'm not sponsored but maybe one day i will be because i love that shop it's super cute i think the waffles are done all we're trying to do is just heat them up we're not trying to like burn the whole place down because i don't want it too crunchy i want them like a really nice soft but still like delectable budget really in camera as best as possible because visual effects are not something that I'm familiar with and I also just assumed that if you could do this in some way shape or form there are so many things that I never even knew the trailer for a movie that's going to drop on this streaming app more than likely a <clears throat> mm. the rest of the CSI mm. CSI I'm going to watch Family Guy Mm. It's always sunny in Philadelphia. They still have it on. Damn, that show don't die. You know what I really want for the house? I really want a really cool cartoon rug. Like those rugs that I showed you on Instagram. They look so badass. I like that for the house. Trent, that hallway. Mm. Just to treat thyroid cancer. It can't be treated in the last eight days. If you weren't, it's the furthest feeling you have. Hey, it's your girl Tia. Um, hold on, let me pause this real quick. So I'm watching Catfish, <laughs> Catfish actually right now, um, because Catfish is like my guilty pleasure. I really enjoy it. It's so crazy how people are still so full to this day about what's a fake profile and stuff like that. But you know, let Neve and Cammy make their money, okay? So stay stupid, y'all. Gullible, stay gullible. That's a nicer way instead of saying stupid because that's mean. Anyway, so um, yeah, I'm getting ready right now to go see The Little Mermaid. I already got my makeup on and I love my outfit. It's super duper cute. Oop. Wear this cute beanie or something. And I like that the beanie is crocheted and also the sweater is crocheted. 
I got this really cute jumpsuit. And then I'm wearing a long plaited, gorgeous skirt. And I love how I did my makeup too. So pretty, I love it. Perfect for the Little Mermaid earrings for the movie. Cause I'm watching Little Mermaid. These are perfect, oh my God. Okay. Let's put these bad boys on. I think I actually got a big ass like necklace that is like she shells too. So I might wear that. I'm taking my mom to getaway to come to the bridge, you know, like if you went to high school, you could take off, you go off the 110 and then you cross the street from that freeway. And then, yeah, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> See, it's right there. My mom was freaking out. <laughs> I know, but just stay to the side. That's all you have to worry about. <sighs> but yay, Little Mermaid. We're gonna watch the one at 440. So we're gonna have time because I have grape juice. It must be real small. Yeah, it's like well, a, it's literally. It's literally a small because I brought the smallest bag ever <laughs> to um, sneak my snacks in, so it doesn't look too obvious. Like I have a backpack or like a tote bag, a tote bag full of shit. But honestly, no one cares. At the end of the day, like they have to be really strict and like super anal. Whoever's in the front to be checking your bags like that, but nobody be doing that at all. The bridge, dun, 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 the bridge, or the rave. The sun finally came out today. It said, it said, hello, hello. It's a thrift shop. I don't think it's a thrift shop. It's not thrift though. It's, it's super cute, oh. but it ain't thrift, I'll tell you that. A play? They have one too, too. A Tina Turner play? Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, I would love to go there. No, that shit's disgusting. I hate. No, they fucked it up. It's nasty as fuck. I hate this hummus place. Mm -mm, never again. Never fucking again. Yeah. I'm so excited. I forgot to bring my tissues though. Because I know I'm going to cry. <laughs> I know I'm going to cry. <laughs> I'm going to cry. Yeah, it used to be an ice cream shop. Wasn't it like, fuck, what was it? I think it was like frozen yogurt or something. Wow. It looks so, uh, yeah. It's an acai bowl thing. Okay. Yeah, so it's, we have a fucking hour. <laughs> So we're gonna kill time. Do you want to go to islands or do you want to like get a little snack or something? Or do you want to like huh? um, I should probably not drink anything since you know the whole situation with my health so maybe so it's best I'm just taking one day at a time I was recording <laughs> Oh shit <laughs> The way you just <laughs> Are you an influencer now? <laughs> Mama, I'm trying. Okay, do do your thing. Go with your dream, girl. Shit. I'm, I'm trying. Get your sponsorships. That's okay, but right I need there. you to know how to hold the phone and <laughs> want my dreams to come true. Huh? Those pants are bomb. What? Those pants. I need to be in the car. I pulled them out. I forgot I had them. Those are I'm nice as fuck. Okay, I said, Better have some more yeah. <laughs> my mama has a second closet she has a walk-in closet now ever since i moved out and she's loving it <laughs> yeah i want some starbucks the iced lemon cake that looks good i always wanted to like have a taste of it Baby, so cute. <laughs> oh yeah, that baby is so cute. I'm still having baby fever all the time. Wait a minute, I just see you here. Oh my god, I tell you, you just died. 
Well, Ooh. I died in a while ago. I died in, for Mother's Day. Well, you know I didn't know it's nothing about Mother's Day, girl. <laughs> I don't know. I, I've been died this. Whatever you did to show you, know. Thank you. You're so collective. Yeah, I want my house to be eclectic, but I'm so nervous to get to that step because like you have to paint your walls and you have to have like there's so many things you have to do and I'm like, am I ready for that? But I'm like, I am. Like why am I so scared to be creative like, at my own place? Walk in the curtains already. I'm like, whoa, that just took you away. Yeah. You know what? I got a room that I, I wanna paint. <laughs> so help me in that room. Yeah, what what color do you want to paint the room? Oh my god, lavender would be so pretty. Oh wow, lavender? That's and now nice. I get your head, let me look at you here, I get ideas like a shade of that dark purple onto lavender, you know? You know how professional you have to be to get to that type of paint to well, do an ombre somebody, on the wall? When you spray, you probably could do it, but I have to really know what I'm doing, you know? So I'll yeah. get somebody else, you know, not the paint. I mean, there's YouTube videos that's, about that's it, too. Popped in my head. I'm going to be my next thing with that YouTube video, you know? There's always YouTube videos. How old was he? I feel like he's coming from first grade, like the girl. Aww. He's so cute. You're getting older as a kid, and we both stay stuck in a rut to go with the times, you know? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, I even mean, President Kater says that, and I'm like, I, I definitely agree with him on that, you know? You know, it's only some things you can't, you know, some things you ain't gonna know, but you. Yeah, I don't know how people can stay mm -hmm. in the 70s or in the 60s. I'm not like, like, oh, let me tell you about it. I'm not talking about it or talking about it because I really like it. Oh, the mermaid is so good. Oh my god. It was amazing. I don't want to be a spoiler, but you guys got to see it. It's Whoa. so good. Wow, like I am still so shocked. And I usually never would like to watch a movie again, but I will literally watch that fucking movie again. It was so good. That even before she um, was going to be Little Mermaid, I look at her face and she looks very like, what's it called? Hallie already looks very like magical like her face is very unique in general and i've always said that so for her to become a mermaid for her to be the choice of a mermaid and then her voice because the voice matters because when you're a little well when you're ariel you have to know how to sing and um she knows how to sing <laughs> okay i let me tell you something what i said about uh, the reason they picked her was because of her eyes kind of being wide apart, you know? Mm -hmm. They said something about that. You know, I'm not sure what that means, but she has beautiful faces. No, it's like just that. like, yeah. it's more like she doesn't have like, she has a very unique face. And yeah. as a mermaid or those type of people, you're gonna look kind of different than a human being. That's what they said about her eyes. They are kind of And then eyes. also, she killed the audition. <laughs> she probably made everyone fucking cry. Like, they're singing, I know it took them away. They're like, whoa, 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 what? <laughs> so I'm so proud of her. I'm so happy. The movie was amazing. Honestly, this is like the best live action movie out ever from Disney. Because everything else is a flop. Flip, flop, 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 flop. Really bad. It ain't good, let me tell you that. Yeah. Like, when it comes to live action, when a cartoon turns into live action, it's always a fail because of how their CGI and how they make the animals look realistic. When the whole reason why we like it in a cartoon version is because we like their face, their expressions. So, I think they did a really good job in this movie where the crab's eyes. At first, when I first saw it in the trailer, I was like, what the fuck is these goofy eyes for? But everything all blended well together in the movie. Oh, and the uh, crab and the bird are so funny. Oh my gosh. I'm that shit was laughing. fucking hilarious. I'm just so fucking happy right now. Like, wow, I'm so proud of her. I feel <laughs> like I'm her older sister and I'm rooting for her. I'm just, oh. I want to watch it again. I want to watch it again. It's so goddamn good. I love it so much. And Prince Eric, at first I was like, he fine. He, he all right. But I was like, damn, Prince Eric. I like how you row your boat. <laughs> how you row your boat, Sandy. <laughs> but no, he's cute. 
and the chemistry was definitely there i love that because like when two actors come together you y'all really gotta play the act okay y'all gotta act like y'all really in love with each other or the audience can tell y'all not really feeling each other oh yeah chemistry was there chemistry was definitely there and Haley, holly i keep on saying Haley, but it's holly like holly berry holly is so like talented even when the times when she couldn't talk mm -hmm. you know through the movie her face expressions that might be harder than you know the talking acting yeah you know? that's really hard because you can't look like plain in the face you have to everything really like in your face you know? yeah everything but she's so gorgeous to look at she, i mean right. you're like come <laughs> on all she has to do is smile and i'm like wow i'm amazed yeah, great job great team great team. job i'm so proud of everybody i like wow i want that movie say, on dvd say, on i just want it on my list <laughs> definitely keep it on my list oh something you got you gotta have you have my kids you gotta show that to your kids you know? hell yeah so i can't like wait to pop my baby up but yeah i <laughs> i'm just so happy you know how I feel about my baby Hallie. She killed it, okay? David Diggs, he's so talented. He's so amazing. I love my Sebastian. Javier, he did the damn thing. I love him. And he's just fine to look at, to be honest. Like, <laughs> Jacob, he's adorable. He did a perfect job as Flounder. Melissa killed it as Ursula. I loved it. Prince Eric, <laughs> let me jump on your boat, Zaddy. <laughs> And Aquafina or whatever her name is, she actually did a great job. I love it.